Thanks for joining me again today on a overview of our RPO sequences. Today I'm going to be covering the differential uh, forces subfolder and in that in particular I'm going to be covering the maintain natural motion circumnav RPO sequence. And for this sequence the idea of when you want to use this is when you're already in a natural motion circumnav so you need to start in that. Um, and once again the difference is the reason why you use this over a perhaps a just a regular coast is if you have a differential presence of either drag um, or the solar um, reflectivity, either the coefficient or the area. Uh, if there is a difference between your RPO satellite and your target, instead of having a natural motion of circumnav, um, due to the presence of differential forces, you will drift and sort of spiral away. Uh, so in this example here, I have an RPO. I am in a natural motion circumnav start. So I'm pretty close to my target, 150 meters behind it. Um, this is going to, the sequence right here will go ahead and launch me into that RPO. Uh, and this sequence right here is going to update my spacecraft parameters to have a different coefficient of reflectivity. Uh, the target has one, this has two, so they're different there. And let's just go ahead and see what this looks like if I were to just coast without trying to maintain um, the natural motion circumnav. So that went ahead and executed. Um, here's my RPO over here. You can see that you know, it starts off looking semi-normal. I don't quite hit as far as the other side of that cross over there, the 150 meters in front. And then I start to spiral away. So that's characteristic if you do have a um, coefficient of reflectivity difference or some sort of um, reflectance value difference there. Now, if instead of I were to coast, but to switch over to this maintain natural motion circumnav, um, you'll see the parameters that you have are to how long you would like to maintain it. In this case, it's half a day. The maximum of error you'd like to maintain. If this is smaller, it's going to have to perform smaller, more burns. Um, also, if your difference in force models is larger, it's going to have to perform more burns. Um, who am I? In this case, I'm RPO1. Uh, That's just the name of my satellite. Um, what engine model am I using? Am I using finite or impulsive burns here? I'm just going to stick with impulsive for today, but both work. Um, and then what is the name of the sequence? It is maintain natural motion circumnavs. So you can see as it goes through, it's going to be doing a series of small burns and propagating forward to make sure that you stay within tolerance. Um, and if I were to over propagate, it's going to back propagate uh, to the end of this maintain duration here. Let's go ahead and kick that off. Uh, this sequence does have a couple of targeters in it. There is, there's going to be a couple of maneuvers. So you it, will see once this finishes and completes a natural motion circumnives with a couple of um, kinks or points in it where it has to perform a maneuver to stay within that, in this case, 10 meter tolerance. Um, so natural motion circumnav, once it's done converge, you'll see it, it'll be centered around that target. And then you'll see a couple um, points in it over here in the 3D graphics window, so it's converged, where it has to perform a maneuver here and a maneuver here in order to maintain um, that natural motion circumnav uh, motion with the target in the center here. And if I want to take a quick look at the report and graph manager, we can run down here and do a maneuver summary report. Taking a quick look at this, it looks like it took five maneuvers for that half day time period. And um, each of these is on the order of about two or so millimeters per second. This one's um, five millimeters per second, this one's one. So these will vary a little bit, but still this is not super expensive to maintain, um, even with a 100% difference in the coefficient of reflectivity. All right, thank you uh, for joining me on that overview of the maintained natural motion um, circumnav sequence. Thanks.